I was never born. It's a really odd thing to say. I was never born and I'll never die. The whole concept of a me or an I disintegrated. Everything that constructed my world, what I knew, what I believed, what I valued, what I thought I loved, my purpose, the meaning I had, the hope, the faith. It's a devastating thing when all of that starts to crumble, starts to disappear. It feels horrible. It's painful. I thought I existed. I thought I was real. I thought I had a certain kind of past, a certain story that had a real beginning, a middle, and some sort of end that was unknown, that was a script that would be written eventually. All of these stories disintegrated. These beautiful stories What's left was the fullness of everything that was always the case. What's left is total and complete wholeness. Perfection beyond understanding. What's left is the simplicity of this. The body breathing. the body seeing, birds chirping, the wind blowing, all of these descriptions sound like separation sound like things are actually happening. But they're all one in the same. It's all just a happening. The seeming end of me, the seeming death of me, was the seeing that I was never born, I never existed, and I'll never die.
I can describe the functioning of the body, what we call a body. We don't really know exactly what it is and how it's functioning and but I can attempt to describe that everything continues. What we call thoughts, emotions, confusion, doubt, happiness, peace, anger, sadness, love, joy, those words are all so empty now. All of it is just energy playing, expressing, dancing. And this isn't noticed or narrated. There isn't a saying of, I'm not here. Sadness is here. Confusing thoughts are arising. Doubtful thoughts are arising. It's just what's happening. It's all happening on its own, automatically, spontaneously, without an agent, without a doer, without an actual entity behind any of it, owning any of it. What's left is a body that was fully functioning, that was fully capable. And the I did not need to be there for it to just function. All of it was happening already. The body doesn't need an illusory self to do what it was already doing all along. What we call a body is not separate from everything. This is all wholeness, expressing, dancing, looking like anything and everything. And all of these things are just Things that we put labels on, we conceptualize, we conceptually solidify them, then they seem separate, they seem other than. When things dissolve back into the unknown, Then it's seen that everything was an unknown all along. There's just unknowing. <laughs>